Ladies and gentlemen, Son of Celluloid is back here at Days of the Dead, and we are standing here with the legend himself, Doyle. How's it going, man? It's great. And the, I'm a huge Misfits fan, have been since I was a kid, and it is truly a pleasure to meet you. Now, um, how did you originally adopt the name Doyle? Where did that come from? I used to call uh, one of my brother's friends Doyle, and then he called it to me. So I didn't know what the fuck his name was, and then it got stuck on me. That works. Now, um, at, at what point, like, when you joined the Misfits, was there a point where you, like, you guys realized that you were starting a whole new genre, or were y'all just doing what you do and let the chips fall where they may? Uh, genre, no, just, uh, we knew Glenn was great, you know, mm -hmm. and uh, we just liked what we were doing, you know, so. Now, you, uh, when you were touring around with the Misfits, that was a really crazy time in, like, punk history, and everything was really getting going. Do you have any good stories of a show that just got out of control? They all got out of control. <laughs> Excellent. Um, now, these days, you've been doing the thing with Danzig, the, uh, doing, doing some Misfit songs with him. Do you have any particular songs that are your favorites to play these days? Yeah, the last one. Excellent. Now, uh, your signature guitar. Yes. Uh, you, of course, made that yourself. Um, do you get approached by other bands wanting you to make stuff for them? Yeah, but I'm not doing that. I don't want to make them for me. I don't, I don't blame you. Now, uh... You've said Abominator, of course, is the uh, most recent album. Excellent album. Thank you. Uh, you've said in interviews that you already have a lot of music in the can. When might we see uh, some more of that come out? Uh, we were just talking about that right now. Um, Dr. Chud has one song to finish, so we can start rehearsing for our tour coming up in August. And mm -hmm. uh, that record's done. We just got to mix it, title it, and make the art. Okay. And uh, we'll put it out when I say to put it out because I'm the label. Excellent. Now, you are the uh, primary songwriter, not lyrics, but songwriter. I write the music and arrange it, and uh, my singer writes all the lyrics and vocal melodies, and I don't touch any of that. All right, now, your, um, your songwriting style, do you, is it, I've got this idea and i got to get down before I lose it, or do you sit down and say, okay, it's time to write a song? Uh, you just write every day, that's what you do. You just fuck around every day, and you stumble across shit, and you just put it all together. Sometimes you write a song in its entirety. You know, which you have to have a recorder there because once you start on a new part, you have to remember what the right hand did. You'll remember what the left hand did. Right. But if you don't have the exact thing the right hand did, it's, sometimes it sucks. Yeah. And you're like, why does it suck? I can't <laughs> understand why it sucks. It's the right hand. All right, good deal. Well, man, I'll get out of your hair. I would right. appreciate you talking to me. And stay here on the Sun of Cellulose YouTube channel for more interviews from Days of the Dead.